Hi, the internet's like the wild, wild west. I mean, there's people with blogs and so websites posting all sorts of information. A lot of it total falsehoods, misrepresentations, half-truths, uh, and once in a while, the real truth. Uh, how do you tell what's right and what's wrong? Well, I can't get into that too much, but as far as people recommending software or services, look at their own site. Look at the recommender's, recommender's site and see if what they're recommending has worked for them. Look at their site's uh, page rank. If their page rank is zero or one, and they're telling you how you're going to get more links back to your site, how you're going to get higher in the search engine, hey, forget about it. It didn't work for them. Same thing with people recommending Twitter. If they don't have a decent or a large number of followers, well, hey, look, it's not working for them. Why listen to their advice? Now, here's uh, uh, Judy's the number of followers that she has um, as of uh, October the 4th. And you can see it's a, sub a substantial number. But more important than the number is look at this graph for the last three months. I mean, this is how she's built up her following. Now, you might say, why is the Twitter following important? Well, it's important if you do it the way she has, and that is focus on the people you want to be following you, not just random. An example would be a realtor or a lawyer. They're going to get most of their business from people within a geographic range of their office, let's say 10 or 25 miles. That's where most of their business is going to come from. So what they want to do is focus getting their followers within that same radius. And then if you have the capability, which we do, to search people who have in their profile or in their tweets, their messages that they send out, have expressed an interest, oh, uh, looking for a new home, considering moving up to a new home, looking for a, a uh, real estate attorney or looking for a, a probate attorney, etc. So you combine the interest expressed in their profile or in their tweets with their radius and then you can build up directed followers for your messages. So then you, once you have a, a big enough following you can send out direct messages if you want or you can do what we do and um, which is a, a very interesting little system we have here. If you take a look, this is our blog site. The uh, main website is websitetrafficbuilders.com, and the blog is at the same place, except there's a backslash, and then website traffic builders again, and that's our blog. You can see here on October 2nd, there's a, a, a post here about software for auto posting to classified sites. So the way we have this WordPress blog set up is as soon as we do this post, it automatically, without any other further working it or anything, will take this post and uh, send it over to Twitter. And then it will also send it over to Facebook. So in one post, we're sending it out to thousands and thousands of Twitter followers we're sending it out to all our followers on Facebook. So let's take a look. Here's the post about um, the software for Craigslist and Backpage. Now if we go over and we take a look, here's Judy's uh, Twitter page. And you could see right over um, here this post, which was uh, at 8 a.m. on October 2nd. There's her post about the free software. So what it does is it takes it, it puts it over here, and if you click on this shortened link, it'll take you right back to her blog. Now let's take a look at Facebook. Same thing if we look at Facebook over here. Here is the post, uh, Friday at 8 a.m. And if you go over here, this link, it says view original post, it'll take the person who's reading this right back to the original post. So, for w uh, again, the system works with a WordPress blog, and 
you're increasing your readership. By increasing your Twitter followers, you're increasing your readership on your blog post. So again, if you're a local attorney, if you're a realtor, you're putting out interesting stuff in your blog, and you have a tremendous amount of Twitter followers, you have a Facebook page, they all incorporate into this system, and now you're getting your message out to thousands and thousands of more people by building up a good following on Twitter. Uh, it's something that a lot of realtors and a lot of uh, uh, lawyers aren't doing, and so for the people who get in quick, uh, can take good advantage of this. Uh, again, it does. It's not magic, and and the real key here is besides having directed Twitter followers, is that you put out good, useful, informative information in your blog. I appreciate you listening. Thanks.